Hi everybody, it's Kelly, also known on Twitter as Kellyann1977, and I have not done a vlog in nine days today. So I figured I'd go ahead and I did one. Um, when I was going to school, you know, when I was working as well, it was easier to do more vlogs because I had things to talk about, I had gossip, and don't have so much of that. Um, all week, my allergies have been really bad. Um, it's mainly in my eyes. And I didn't sleep that great last night. Um, so I get the itchy, watery eyes. I get pain behind my eyes. Woke up with a runny nose. It's not so bad now, but it's still a little red, even though I'm putting lotion on. Um, I used my face mask today that I got at Walmart. It's like $1.50. Um, and I try to use a face mask once a month. Um, and then I have my clay mask that I use a couple times a month. Uh, I wash my face every day with different products that I have. I have toners. And now I have um, this gold thing I got from the Dollar Tree of all places. So I grabbed two of them. So next time we go up there, because they don't sell this product at this Dollar Tree in Vermont, I have to go to New Hampshire. Um... And if they have any more, I grab a couple more. I wanted to use it before I grab more than what I would need. Um, and it's supposed to help with wrinkles and fine lines. And it's also supposed to hydrate your skin. And it is a gold mask. It's a liquid. You put it on. You wear it for 10 minutes, 10 to 15. And it hardens as it dries. And then you just wash it off. It's a very thin mask um the clay ones are very heavy and you definitely feel them when you put them on they're usually gray or a tan color so i've been doing that stuff but uh some days are just better than others i guess <laughs> it also matters how much we cook here because we don't have a vental system um that helps take the steam out of the house when you're cooking um, so that does matter too. So it's been weird. Past like three days has been in the upper 40s. Yesterday it was 54 and today it is 33. <laughs> so the weather keeps changing and then for three or four days the ice is melting and the snow is melting but we still have snow outside. Um, and the grass is starting to come through. So you know I have really bad hay fever. I'm allergic to everything that's outside as well so i just been really feeling it but as you can see we do still have some snow out there um yeah my nose is starting again of course so and peppy also has allergies as well so I've been starting to play Grand Theft Auto online. Um, I like to play by myself. So I rob 7-Eleven stores, that's what I call them. I uh, steal a pretty good expensive car and I sell it. There's a cool down and certain shops, body shops, don't like every car. <laughs> so uh, sometimes you have to pick, you have to drive around until you find one. I just started a motorcycle club. And the cheapest business to have is forgery. So that's what I'm going to start with. But it's going to take forever <laughs> to get the money. Um, so I've been doing that a little bit. And I started to play a game that I got for $10 off on Steam called East Shade. And uh, it's in a game where animals are people and people don't exist. And it's uh, considered a walking simulator, but it has quests. You can read notes, and you can read books to get a feel of what this island's about. And uh, the story is that your mother is laying on her deathbed, and you are a good artist, and she thinks you can do even better. So she asks you to go to the island, and she wants you to paint four places. And I'm guessing as soon as you do that, then you complete the story, because that's really what it's about. But... 
there's different areas, four or five different little cities and towns and stuff. Some are wealthier than others, so I'm in the process of doing that. I uh, gave some pictures away as a gift, and I got some money in return, which is called Glowstones is money. Um, so I just bought a coat so that I can stay outside at night because it gets really cold at the dock. And that cost 80 stones. <laughs> and then you gotta make sure you have canvases so you can continue to paint. Um, so I just took a commission and I painted three chickens and got 15 stones. But if you buy canvas, it's five stones. If you try to make it yourself, you have to try to find wood. And fabric I have tons of fabric but wood is very hard to find so you really do want to do whatever you can to make money in this game so that you can buy canvases um, it's a cute little game so uh, that's where I am I got about four hours into that game um, some people have a couple and beat it right away other people really explored and they have 27 33 hours into the game um, it's a really cute game, and I do like walking simulators. And it's always nice to have a walking simulator where you can do quests and befriend people as well. So it's a little different. I play it from really tired. Um, last night I ended up playing The Sims 4 for about two hours. So I have two more classes to take, and she will graduate college. She has an A minus grade right now for um, GPA. And then, uh, I hit the wrong button last night and I made her cheat on a term paper and I didn't realize I hit the wrong button. So uh, she got an F in that class. <laughs> uh, oops, I got caught. Um, so as soon as she's done with this week, <sighs> then she can move out and get a better job. Um, so for her uh, debate and research, she's a six right now. She was a two when I started it, so that's not too bad. Um, I haven't been able to find the secret society because I don't have what they need. <laughs> so to find the secret society, you have to give an offering of a rare stone. Um, it said something else that you could give too, but I don't remember what it was. So um, I know for my next character, because she's going to have a child, at least one. And then when she dies and I play as that character, boy or girl, I'll make sure I have a couple of them. Because I want to understand what the secret society is. <laughs> um, so she is doing the debate team and she's um, a seasoned debater now. And uh, once you fill up the bar, and every week there's different things to do could be um, research a topic, practice debating, win a debate, watch news channel, stuff like that. Um, once that bar fills up, which took me two weeks of uh, sim weeks to do it. Then if she goes ahead and she debates and she wins, she'll get extra points in her classes. Um, so that's it's like extra credit. So that's cool. Um, and it's, of course, going to help her for what she's going with. Um, she's talking to a couple of Sims, one's right ahead, and he is taking the same degree program as her. So that's kind of cool, because uh, I think they might end up getting married. So I will be going ahead and building my own small house, tiny house, um, once she graduates. So I'll be able to uh, look at everything and see all the pretty colors. And I downloaded a bunch of stuff too, like pictures and rugs and wallpapers as well. Because I like variety in my game. Um, so I might play a little bit more today. I don't know. I'm still just tired and didn't sleep good. <sighs> Nothing new though. I never sleep good. <laughs> um... So this Wednesday, I'm going to be taking my mom out to eat to kind of our fancy place. It's called uh, Wine Gate, and it's a three-star restaurant. The only other restaurant we had like this was a four-star restaurant, but they went out of business um, out here. They have another restaurant in um, New Hampshire, 
but it's not as nice as the one that was out here. Um, so this is really the only fancy place you can go to unless you want to go to the tap jar or something that's called. And they sell food, but they're mainly a bar, pub and bar kind of thing. Um, so that's the only other fancy restaurant out here. So I'm going to take her there Wednesday. Uh, but Sherry made me mad Saturday. I just called to see how she was doing, haven't heard from her. And, uh, you know, she wants to talk about something that happened two years ago and four years ago and ten years ago. And I'm really tired of re-listening to her talk. <laughs> um, so I finally put my foot down and I said, you know, I don't call you to get aggravated. This is the second time in three weeks that you have pissed me off. I have stress disorder and I don't need to be aggravated. So if you got to continue to do this and want to keep talking about the past that has nothing to do with now, then we can just talk texting. And then she stopped. So, <laughs> and usually when I spend time with her, I like to do it in public places because she's aware of other people listening and she behaves herself. But if I bring her to the house, she doesn't do that. And she ir aggravates me and irritates me, and I don't need that. So, you know. Um, so I'm going to meet her over there at 12, probably stay an hour, hour and a half tops, and then go get Craig lunch. <laughs> um, so, not too much more going on. My husband's just uh, trying to do his classwork. I think the second week in April they have another vacation. Because um, they get two during fall and spring. None during the summer. And... He will have six days off <laughs> when uh, in May six days off before he starts his summer classes all online four of them and he's going to stop putting applications out in two weeks he's hoping to have a job by the end of March so yeah so other than that not really too much more going on a cat sat yesterday um, I mean Saturday and then uh, she came home yesterday, so, um, but yeah, not too much more going on. So Wednesday when I go out will be 11 days I haven't gone out. <laughs> I always figure as we made plans with Craig's mom a couple times, but he wasn't feeling good and then he had extra work to do and uh, she was doing food shopping one day and so sometimes it's just hard to get together and it's going to be even harder when Craig goes back to work and does school. Um, but he will be done in December. He's just going to do the best that he can and hopefully he can get his bachelor's degree. If not, he'll just have the associate's computer science. Um, he's really having a hard time with statistics. It's not easy. This is his second time. Um, not last semester, but semester before he did it and he got a 60, but they didn't give him a tutor until week eight and there's only 16 weeks. It just wasn't enough time for him to bring up his grade point average. I noticed week three, I was struggling and by week four, I had a 20, but I took it during the summer and I only had 10 weeks. So I had two tutors that were online and I worked with both of them so but I mean I did 10 to 20 hours of work a week um, I would give them what the problem was they would change one number and then we would keep going over it until I could do it on my own and that's how I did it <laughs> which was a lot of work um, so it's not easy and then he has another class that he can't take until August uh, that he didn't know about. He thought he would be done this summer. Um, that branches out 
warrant statistics and you have to take it and you have to pass it to graduate and you can't take it until you pass statistics with at least a 70 so you know always something um but other than that not too much more going on i'm going to make some barbecue chicken today and um i don't know maybe a noodle or some white rice and broccoli or something like that and we each have a, a small salad made in the fridge that we can have with it. So Craig went to go visit his mom. He should be getting there now. Um, and then I don't know if he's going to come home for lunch tomorrow because he has two classes tomorrow. Um, before and, and he goes to his two classes, comes home, which is usually about 1145 sometimes 12 because classes do run over sometimes um and then i usually have lunch ready for him before 12 and then he leaves at 12 30 to go back but he was supposed to have an appointment with somebody today for his internship that he's supposed to be doing this summer and uh apparently the person called out sick and nobody notified him okay so apparently they only have one person for this internship department. Kind of weird. And I don't know. I've been using my toothbrush, my toothbrush, and my toothpaste for eight days now. That's the one with the coal in it that's supposed to help whiten your teeth naturally. I think I see a difference. But sometimes you want to see what you want to see. But I think my teeth do look brighter. And I'm still drinking soda. I mean, I'm not going to stop drinking soda. Um, I don't drink coffee. Sometimes I drink tea. Um, so. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, well, I'm going to let everybody go. I don't really have too much more to talk about um, as of right now. Um, so I hope everybody has a great week. And uh, today is... March 9th. That is the day. <laughs> Thank you for watching, guys. I do appreciate it. Any concerns, comments, you can always leave them down below. If you just need to vent about something, you can always do that. If you want to tell me about a new game, a new movie, a new TV program, a new book, um, don't hesitate. Bye, guys. Have a great day.